Few of us, you know, it's me, uh, the captain, you know, the Billy Sharp, the older ones in the in the group, you know. Um, we speak a lot to the boys, um, try to keep everyone remaining positive. But you know, I manage the most positive out of everyone. You know, he keeps us um, still full of confidence and let us know that we're here, we belong in this league. And you know, once one win comes, uh, you know, a few, a lot more will come. So we're all confident. There's no um, down in the dumps um, at our club at the minute. You know, it's weird because last year I, was, I wasn't scoring really, but I was more happy with my form and my general play. And this year, I've like, got a few goals early on in the season and I'm not as happy as my, my overall play, so it's a weird one to weigh up. I definitely could contribute more um, and I've got to start bringing that to the party because there are the times that the boys, as an older senior player with experience, I, I need to bring that to the party. Yeah, it was probably the toughest decision of my football career. Um, you know, the setup there that they've got at the minute is really good. I know Stephen Kenny's had a, a tough start with the results and what's gone off, but he's a really good manager, really good staff there. Keith Andrews, Damien Duff. Um, obviously, I love playing for my country, but I had to put myself first, my career, my, my family. You know, I want to play in the Premier League for as long as possible and be at my best playing in the Premier League. So I had to make the decision. Um, and I feel it's the right one. Christmas Day is waking up uh, with the kids, uh, opening the presents, having an early lunch, midday 12, no wine, no beer, um, a J to O if you're lucky, and um, training at three, four o'clock, and here, then we go for a meal here and we stay in a hotel or if we're traveling away, we travel on that day to wherever we go. But even if it's a home game, we stay in a hotel the night before. Oh, so Christmas day, we're staying in a hotel. I think it's got to the point now where I've been doing it for so years and training every day on Christmas day. I, I, I haven't had a Christmas day off. It kind of, it's part and parcel being a footballer. There's good things about footballers. Being a footballer, there's bad things. And that's just part of it, you know, I'm lucky enough to play this game and, and uh, I, I take everything that comes with it. Boxing Day is good, you know, we had, we've had a few home games on Boxing Day, it's been a really good atmosphere, full house. Um, something about it uh, that makes it special, obviously, lots of families there on days out and, you know, some kids, some kids' first games and people's first games from tickets that they've got for Christmas, so, Really good atmosphere and we've got some good results on Boxing Day, so long may that continue. My Premier League hero growing up was Thierry Henry. He was an all-round best player in the league at the time. Goals, the way he played football, the way he enjoyed football, um, it put a smile on my face as a kid. Yeah, definitely inspiration to be like Thierry Henry, the way he played, scored, the way he looked after the ball and the main thing was the way how he enjoyed playing football with a smile on his face and expressed himself. I'd have to say the volley against uh, Manchester United when he flicked it up and turned and lobbed it over Barthez, I think that was one of the Premier League's greatest goals um, and that's when you really realise how, how good of a player he was. No, never met Thierry Henry, they say never meet your hero so I'm not meeting him. <laughs>